Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Tech Lab Tuesday. My name is Dave Monahan and I'm with Goodson Tools and Supplies. Today we're going to talk about probably one of the uh, more simpler tools that we have in our product line. But it's a very, very important tool because you can't grind your flywheels until you utilize uh, this tool, which is called our dowel pin puller. It's our GA600 dowel pin puller. Very, very simple tool to use. Like I said, the, its whole design is to get these dowel pins out of flywheels, uh, heads, blocks, uh, other applications that are out there. And what we have is we have a hardened collet. This one right here is hardened. We have to do a, a, a very specific hardening process to these collets because if we get them too hard, they'll become brittle and they'll actually break when we uh, put this sleeve uh, uh, to tighten them onto that uh, dowel pin right there. If we get them too soft, then they'll just flare out and they won't actually get a good bite. Uh, onto that uh, dowel pin. So it's, it's important that we do our job uh, to supply you with this very high quality uh, tool. These dowel pins can be real, real boogers, let me tell you. Uh, I mean, they absolutely can. Some of these dowel pins uh, uh, can be, uh, you know, they're as hard as Superman's kneecap. I mean, let's just get to cut to the chase right there. They're hard, they're chrome plated, they're quite small, and uh, we got to get them out of the way before we can grind this flywheel because when you're grinding a flywheel, I got the wear surface here, I've got the clutch mounting surface up here. I take 20 thousandths off of here. Well, by gosh, I got to take 20 thousandths off here, but I can't do that because this dowel pin's in the way, so I got to remove the dowel pin. Assembly of the tool is really, really quick and really easy. Uh, good machinists that we are, we always measure before we, we proceed. This happens to be 236. We call that six millimeter where I grow up. And uh, so get the six millimeter collet. We'll put that on, and you can see it just screws right on there. It's all uh, half inch, 20 uh, threads. Uh, the tightening sleeve gets in position. Place our dowel pin puller over the top of the dowel. And then with the slide hammer, we want to press this sleeve over the collet and therefore get a good bite uh, on that dowel pin uh, that we're trying to remove from this flywheel. Once we got that good, we go the other way up and remove it. And you can say, well, wait a minute there, Mr. Dave. That dowel pin is still in that flywheel. It's not in your collet of your dowel pin puller. What the heck's going on? Well, I'll tell you what's going on. As I said earlier, these things can be as hard as Superman's kneecap, chrome plated, small six millimeter diameter. Several years ago, I was in a machine shop and a guy uh, uh, turned me on to this, uh, uh, I consider the machinist hack for <laughs> lack of a better term. And he told me that if I was to take a little dab of, of, uh, of uh, valve lapping compound, this happens to be 120 grit. And keep in mind, valve lapping compound is nothing more than, than grease with the grit in it. That's what we use to lap our valves under our valve seats. But because of that grit in there, we can place that dowel, uh, lapping compound right onto that dowel, okay? And that grit's gonna help give us a, an extra little bite that we're looking for uh, in this. Now, one thing I hadn't showed you yet is how to, as you saw, I got that collet tightened on there. I tried to remove that dowel pin, couldn't. Now I've got my, uh, my lapping compound on there, but I've gotta open up that collet again. So that's what this removal basin is designed for. It sits right there, and I take this hammer I got right here in my hand, whack it thusly, and then my dowel is released, and I can go back through the uh, tightening process. I uh, got that released, get it back up there on top, get my tightener in position. Look at that. Pulled that dowel right out that time. All because of that little crease. So that's, a, that's just a little machinist hack that we can use a, a lapping compound for other things other than just lapping the valves. It gives us that extra grip we're looking for uh, for removal of these dowel pins. Keep in mind, uh, they're available uh, two different kits. The domestic kit, which has quarter, five sixteenths, three eighths, and seven sixteenths, or the metric kit, four millimeter, five millimeter, six millimeter, eight millimeter. You can mix and match this all the way through. It's got a range of uh, four millimeter through 16 millimeter, or 157 thousandths through 625 thousandths. It's all available at Goodson tools and supplies. You can catch us uh, uh, on the phone. Just give us a call 1-800-533-8010 or catch us on the web at goodson.com. Hope you're enjoying these videos. We're having a lot of fun putting them together for you. We'll see you next time.